What is the cost of not taking care of your health today? When it comes to taking care of our health, we have so many different things we could say we don't have the time to do, we don't have the money to do, right? That's usually the two things, time and money. You know, it's time to take care of you. It's time to get adjusted. It's time uh, to go and, and shop for healthy foods and healthy foods are expensive and taking care of your body is expensive, but it's for you. It's the greatest investment because you're putting it back into you. Because if we're not investing in you, then you're going to wind up paying for it some other time. No matter what, when it comes to your health, you're reaching in your pockets regardless. So you either are in control of your health and taking care of it, investing and enjoying life and everything, or disease process and the lack of doing that, the compound effect of not taking care of your health today will hit you in a much bigger financial and destructive health matter later on. Studies show that the average retired couple needs $400,000 to $600,000 cash after retirement just to take care of their sick bills. Sickness, sickness is the number one cause of debt in America and medical bills are the number one cause of bankruptcy in America. So even if money is your goal, right? Nothing wrong. This is not a right or wrong thing. Even if even if money is a tough thing, maybe you, ra you were raised in a family where they didn't have it and now it's like a very security secure thing to you and you don't want to let it go. Understand that if you're not taking care of your health, what you're doing right now, just think the decision you made right now is going to save you from, from, from the number one cause of debt. It's going to save you from medical bankruptcy and it's going to save you from four to $600,000 cash in, in your later years when you enjoy life and travel and do the things you want to do. So your health, having your health now and investing in your health now allows you to store up the money or potential in your life. So you could then use it later on in life to do the things that you're, you're every day. Someday I'm going to do this. Well, at least you'll have the someday if you're taking care of your health. But so many people have someday, they have wishes and they never get there. In my area, the nursing homes are $127,000 per year and there was zero vacancy. There are waiting lists and not one of those people in the nursing homes ever thought or ever imagined that they would end up there. They're full of regret and the regret is, if I only knew dot, 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 I would have done better here. I would have taken care of my health better here. I would have invested more in my health there. I wouldn't have taken risk over here. So this is like a time machine. You don't have to be in the nursing home. No one will ever, no one plans to get there, but there's absolutely waiting lists to get in. So you have control of that now. So this is why think of health now, what you do today, everything you do today will compound over time to ensure you can have a life that you always wanted to reach your goals, to reach your dreams, and to do all the things that you someday always wanted to do. This is why health today gives you your future tomorrow.